Hi, I'm Jen Rohde, Manager of Integrated Design Studio with Henry Schein Dental. Today we're going to talk about how our team has adapted to the pandemic. From the very beginning, we have responded with care, consideration, and thoughtful planning to design safe environments that promote improved function, confidence, and well-being. We have learned from this experience, applied our knowledge, and continue to plan for the future. But before we get too far ahead of ourselves, let's adjust for today and design with greater intent. In a time of uncertainty, we focus on key design elements that support existing environments and accommodate staff and patient expectations. Let's start with process. It only takes small adjustments to your daily activities to increase infection control, improve practice efficiency, and patient experience. Consider incorporating the following. Give patients a sense of control over their environment with a virtual check-in or a check-in kiosk. Schedule additional time between appointments to reduce queuing. Conduct rescheduling within the treatment room to limit interactions with others in the space. As you evaluate your internal processes, it is just as important to consider the staff experience. We would encourage you to evaluate how your staff navigates the current space, make notes for improvement, and set new expectations. One of our main recommendations for the staff area is to include a changing room and laundry services to avoid any contamination outside of the practice. Creating separation within higher use areas support infection control and provide flexibility. You might consider creating clusters of seating or including a separation panel for added protection while keeping the open feel. Partitions can also be incorporated in the business office or wherever there is shared desking to define individual space. Partitions are also a great addition to an open bay layout for improving aerosol containment, privacy, and design interest. For closed rooms, consider adding sliding doors or soffits above open cabinetry. In addition to these design elements, there are small footprint units that are easily placed throughout the office for improved protection and peace of mind. These include air purification systems, aerosol containment units, and hand sanitation stations. Safety considerations in the dental environment expand beyond the design of the space. The interior finishes also impact the day-to-day -day experience for both dental staff and patients. When patients are not in the treatment chair, they are in the waiting room. Even if you plan to utilize virtual check-in, we still recommend allocating a small space for seating if there is a short wait. This may be a couple of chairs or a bench seat. With less furniture comes the increased use of the remaining pieces. Because of this, we highly recommend investing in commercial furniture and fabrics. Although they are at a higher upfront cost, they offer long-lasting warranties, excellent durability, stability, and cleanability. So the design will go out of style before ever showing wear. A patient's perception is their reality, and in a pandemic, an elevated design can seem harder to achieve with all the necessary precautions for safety. It is no longer just dental anxiety plaguing the public, but social anxiety and uncertainty. Biophilic design is a worthy component in combating this apprehension. If you are not familiar, biophilia means the love of nature and humans' innate connection and attraction to the natural world. Biophilic design is a concept that implements elements of nature or products that mimic nature to enhance a user's connectivity to the natural world. There have been many studies that biophilic design is beneficial in reducing a person's stress, increasing productivity, and in some uses, even enhance a person's health. In these images, we have demonstrated how to take a typical environment and introduce biophilic elements to create a warm, natural, and overall inviting space. The pandemic has pushed us all to think differently, adapt, and move forward in ways we had never imagined. As we look at dental office design through this new lens, we ask ourselves, could we do better? What should we take with us from this experience, and what can we leave behind? The future of dental office design is in the palm of our hands, but innovation takes time. Know that creative minds are at work with IDS. We are dedicated to redefining dental office design is not just a reaction from today, but a better solution for tomorrow.